Winter 2007, number 24. Let's try this one. Same idea. Yes. Here's N2O. I gotta find it down below. I think that's the only place it appears. And then we've got O2 right here. It's down here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, and then N2O4, it's right there. And that's it. Everything not circled is called an intermediate. So it better cancel. But we're not going to focus on the intermediate. We're going to focus on the what actually appears. I'm not going to pick the oxygen because it appears too many times. I want things that don't appear often. So I'm going to pick N2O or N2O4. It's irrelevant which one you start with. So we'll start with N2O4. I need two in the products. It appears down here. So I need to multiply this by what? Negative two. Negative two, so I raise this to the minus two power. Next. What's that? Why is it negative two? Oh, because I need it in the products. So the negative means I'm flipping the reaction. And the two means I have a two. Just like, same, I need the same coefficient. So for the next one, N2O and N2O, same problem. I have it in the reactants here, but the products here. So I need to take this dumb thing, and I've got to reverse it with the minus sign and multiply by 2, so now it has a 2 coefficient. So this is also minus 2. And now, you could do the last one a couple different ways, but uh, let's see. I guess there's an easier and a harder way. You just do 4. What's that? 4. Plus 1 by 4. Why do you want to do 4? Because it's negative 2 and 1 half to negative 1 and 4 and 1 plus again. Oh, okay. Okay, so you're looking at oxygen. Yeah. So you want 3 here. This is minus 1. So yeah, this better be 4. So that 4 minus 1 equals 3. You multiply these three values, that's k total. How do we get the last one? This one right here? Yeah. Uh, we wanted to focus on O2. So there's three. These O's down here better equal three when they sum up. The first one we had was minus two times one half. That's minus one. So after that, you can't touch those again. After it has a parenthesis, you can't touch it again. Okay. Yeah. After it has a multiplier. So we multiply it times negative two. This is minus 2 times 1 half. That was already there. Okay. So now it's a minus 1. Okay. This better be a positive 4. So that 4 minus 1 is 3. 